Hey cycling community, this is Steve Grusis, the Cycling Greek. In my last video, I warned of overworking, therefore sabotaging yourself two weeks before your goal race. On Monday, I was still reamed from my road race on Saturday. So all I did was a zone one workout. I never even got close to zone two. Now it's Wednesday, two days later, and I'm feeling a lot better. My legs are feeling fresh. And that's a good thing because tomorrow I'm doing the 4th of July Criterium in Davis, California. And that's going to be my only speed work for the week. The workout I'm about to do is 30 to 45 minutes easy spinning and I'm going to throw in two, maybe three accelerations to prime the pump, so to speak, on my lactic acid filtering system. The primary reason I'm doing that is so that I decrease my warm-up that I require tomorrow because time is going to be tight for me. I'm going to be leaving here at 5 a.m. to get to the race site by 8 a.m. and my race start is 9.30. If I can decrease my warm-up time by 15 minutes to 30 to 40 minutes, then that's going to take a lot of pressure off of me. Remember, I'm an old guy, so I need that long warm-up. On top of that, I'm AFib boy now, so I have to warm up my heart evenly and slowly. Look for my race video. I'm going to include... I'm going to include a rear view camera. So I hope I'm not tail gunning at the entire race. Let me know what you do the day before a race. Write below and let me know if there's a difference for your race if you ride the day before or not. And then lastly remember, always remember, comment like subscribe, The Cycling Greek.